guys, Matt from Results Gym. Welcome to another AMRAP. All right, this week, team, we've got five exercises on the menu. Um, no sled, um, so it's it's going to be pretty full on. It's going to be pretty fast. So let's get straight into the demos. All right, where do we start? Burpees and sprints. So start up. It doesn't really matter which end um, you start at. You're, you're running the full length though. Um, if the full length of the of the back room of the gym. So essentially, you find yourself a spot, guys. You start with two burpees, two burpees every time. Dropping straight down, okay. Burpee up. Make sure you get airborne. All right, airborne on the jump. Airborne on the second jump. As soon as you jump, guys, running down. Pretty well to the end. Touch the green locker. Back down. Another two burpees, okay. So that will be one lap. Two burpees up, back, and back. So if you're doing the uh, toughest, you do five of those, so 10 burpees in total. If you're doing not so tough, um, you do four. No worries. Cool, then you hit the slam balls. So we've got the nines and the twelves. Guys, definitely the twelves. Ladies, you can choose whichever you like, okay? So with the twelves, guys, remember, it's a squat that's coming down. Keep everything nice and straight. Straight up, pick it up on the bounce, okay? And just slamming it in, always focus. Try to avoid this and picking it up like this. Dropping down, nice and controlled, up above the head. It's gonna get the heart rate through the roof. Bench side steps. So bench side steps, about 30 on the menu to do if you're doing the toughest one, guys. So already, like I said, this is gonna get the heart rate up a lot. The one, two, three, four, five, as fast as you can. Six, seven, eight. You don't have to jump up too much. It's just more of an agility-based coordination exercise. Every step on every side is one repetition. Okay. Um, pull up TRX. No change to normal, guys. Mix it up. Remember, as long as you focus on going all the way up, all the way down, that's for the stronger guys. Obviously, we've got TRX. Okay, just remember to keep the chest poked out. Avoid sagging. Okay, keep it pos um, poked out and focus on just squeezing those shoulder blades together. Alternatively, okay, all the bands, guys, are located over there. Okay, there's a band here. Either under the foot, if you want to use the bench to get up on it, or under the knee. Remember, drop that knee down, the band should be nice and close to your body. This is just gonna assist you a little bit in those chin-ups. Stick your bands are over there. And the last one, team, the ab sliders. All right, all I just wanted to finish off with. Go with the ab sliders. The discs, all located where the boxing gear is over there. You usually put your hands around on the rubber area. Um, so, fully extend out into that push-up position. And just bring this in to the knees, come around about elbow level, or just in front even, and then fully extend back out. So that's one, okay? Two, three. What you want to avoid, guys, is if you're starting to fatigue and you start to sag and hyperextend, okay? Keep it nice and strong, even if you need to be in that position, okay? And just stay up in that position is a lot better than sort of hyperextending, putting any stress through that lower spine. Get through it, guys, 20 minutes, and have an awesome week.